Your equipment for the free fall experiment is relatively simple. We have a meter stick, a metal conductive ball, a ball dropper with a set screw that allows you to release, the stand which you can adjust the ball dropper's height on, and finally the contact pad which is where the ball lands. The trick to putting the ball in the ball dropper is just this. We take the ball and place it in the cradle of the ball dropper, like so, pressing down on the pin. Then we tighten down the set screw to hold it in place. At this point we're ready to begin our drop. To do so, all we have to do is release the set screw. When you're adjusting the ball dropper or the pad to be in the proper place, you basically just need to place the ball in without taking data, release the ball, and find out where the ball actually hits. Since the ball is struck here, we move the pad in just a little bit to one direction, such that it hits the end of the pad rather than the end that's screwed in. Otherwise, it won't make contact if it gets to this end. So, we go, we do a quick test just to make sure everything works properly, and release. Perfect. On occasion, you may experience equipment trouble. This is relatively easy to solve because it's simply caused by corrosion on the metal contacts. In this case, you may have to take a piece of sandpaper and lightly route the pad. Just to clean that off. Or potentially the ball dropper. In case the electrical contacts on this sensor break, Please notice that the red wire is connected to the copper pad and the black wire is, comes around and is connected to the ball dropper plate. 